At the Discovery Center in Halifax, the new Dinosaur Explorer exhibit is bringing prehistoric creatures to life, offering a hands-on experience for visitors of all ages. But beyond the excitement of towering T-Rexes and fossil digs, the exhibit is part of a larger mission, making STEM education more accessible for young people across Nova Scotia. Engaging students with STEM fields is a great way to develop their critical thinking skills, their problem solving skills. By having experiences that they can, you know, see and do things, touch and feel things, like our, our visitor experience team, for example, are bringing out fossil specimens, our collection, to engage with visitors uh, around this exhibit. Uh, it really helps uh, keep the students kind of engaged, excited, asking more, and um, thinking about historically how some communities or some individuals may not be comfortable in a traditional learning environment. We try to kind of flip it so that it's hands-on, it's play-based, it's interactive and the more fun and play-based you make something the more comfortable that space is to come in and really be able to explore. You know it doesn't feel like a learning space but we are able to sneakily kind of get that STEM learning in there in a way that uh, hopefully resonates and sticks with folks. Through programs like Youth Empowerment in Science, or YES, the Discovery Centre works to provide hands-on STEM experiences to students who might not otherwise have access. But right now, the program is only able to reach about 20% of Nova Scotia youth. And the largest reasons we're only able to reach 20% kind of, of the province is one, just geographical location, uh, you know, isolation, um, but also funding to get out and do programs. For many educators, bringing interactive STEM learning into the classroom isn't always easy. Resources is one of the biggest challenges, it's just having access to what you need, but really I think it's just a matter of providing the resources and opportunities and um, to make it as easy as possible for educators to roll it out. By showcasing engaging, hands-on exhibits like Dinosaur Explorer, the Discovery Centre hopes to inspire the next generation of scientists engineers and innovators. Ultimately I hope that they walk away thinking a little more critically about the world but asking a lot of questions to keep that learning happening. Let it Alfred the signal.